Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here back with yet another 100% achievement guide and this time we're getting it all in AIM Labs. Now this was developed and published by State Space Labs and is usually available for free but you can uh, find some discount on it and get it for absolutely free right now. So, uh, well basically this is just one of those, uh, it's been in the closed beta for a while but basically this is just a game where if you're looking to upgrade your aiming skills, then hey, this be the one. Aim Labs, it's basically a training platform designed by gamers to help sharpen up your core first person shooter aiming skills, which is uh, actually pretty cool. And what's even cooler is, like I said, for, uh, for the original price, it's free, but you can also get it for free on discount right now. Plus there's a whole bunch of easy achievements uh, if not a little repetitive towards the end, but if you do have a turbo controller, this will help immensely. If you don't have a turbo controller, um, that's fine. Uh, it'll, it'll take around four to maybe five hours and you will see exactly what I mean in just a minute. Uh, but with a turbo controller, you can get this done considerably faster. So anyway, what we're going to do first then, when we boot up our uh, main screen, we're going to just click Y to continue on to Aim Lab and we will get our first achievements uh, for changing the weapon skin. So straight away, change the target skin at the top and the weapon skin. That will get you two new achievements and a bit of environment if you want as well. You know, if you like a different color, you know, spice up, spice up your life. If not, then fine. Press Y to finish and then on avatar, banner and title, we're just going to change all of them to whatever. And we'll press Y to finish and that will get us another achievement here as well. Uh, for standout aimer Now first things first what we're going to do is press the left bumper once to go into our settings That we are going to change the countdown timer to absolutely zero So you will need to click on the game at the very top there and countdown duration zero this will basically just help Seconds and it, it will help big time trust me next we are going to go on to uh, controls then over to controller and we're going to change the sensitivity. Now you can change it to whatever you want um, and then change it back. Uh, I basically just changed it to all the way up to six and a half just to be sure. Click save. That will get the next achievement optimal aim for changing the sensitivity. Then you can put it back to whatever it is that you want. So we can just save that and then press the B button to back out. Next, we are going to favorite our first task. So. Uh, press right bumper once to go over to training. Uh, grid shot should be right there. Make sure it is this one right here from Aim Labs themselves. Grid shot 3x3, three three, that's the one you're looking for. Uh, so you can press the Y button if you want to view some details. Uh, but the main thing we're going to do is press X to add it to our favorites. Now that is a pretty favorite of mine, the old three blue balls. Um, but anyway, that will give us the aimer achievement there for favoriting our first task. Now, we can press the A button there to hold. Now, what we're going to do for another two achievements, we'll press the right trigger to begin, and then only uh, press the right trigger once to hit one of your bowels. So, shoot one ball, and then leave it until the 30 seconds is up. Now, the reason we're doing that, we are going to get the uh, first task completed achievement, and for getting 100% accuracy. And also, after this as well, uh, this, now that it is an open beta, it does come with a title update as well. And we're going to get those in the next round. That's for basically beating our first high score in Aim Labs and increasing our average. So, of course, we've only got one point, so that's fine. So, we're going to wait for those two achievements to pop off. There it is. Aim journey started, first task completed, and dead eye for getting 100% accuracy. Now, what you want to do is press the Y button, or in the bottom left-hand corner, it'll say Replay Task. Now, that is exactly what we want to be doing. And this time, the accuracy doesn't matter, just as long as you beat your high score and your average. Uh, so, hey, if, if, if you've got practice at shooting balls, then, uh, well, whoever you're with next should be uh, very afraid, apparently. And, um, yeah, so just keep shooting. Keep shooting those big, crusty, unwashable balls. 
And then we will get the title update nicely and completely. Damn, if it were to go. I tell you what, women are fantastic at this. They can spot a ball a mile off and shoot with a well with insane accuracy. And that's why OnlyFans is very popular these days. Uh, anyway, uh, so with that one being done, you will now get another two achievements. Again, this is for increasing our average and beating our first high score. Then what you can do at the very top of the screen, you can see where it says replay. So that's what we're going to go for next. We're going to replay our, uh, well, basically just watch our first replay. So click replay, click the play button. And then that is that. So that is all of the sort of very easy achievements uh, out of the way. Now we've got the repetitive ones where basically we have to complete 50 tasks, 100 tasks, play grid shot 3x3 three three 100 times and complete 500 tasks. Now, uh, on Steam, there was, uh, there was a bit of a customization on Steam where you could customize some tasks to be literally as short as 5 seconds instead of 30. Uh, at the minute, obviously, with this guide out at the minute, it's not possible. If there are any updates and any title updates, I will be sure to uh, put up some guides or let you know on Twitter, slash X, slash Birdbrain, whatever it's called. And, um, yeah, because maybe we should expect some title updates in the future. I'll tell you what, it would make... I don't think anybody can complain coming back to a, a tidy little game like this. So, yeah, so hopefully um, Xbox does get some more of the Steam customization options in terms of if it can be as short as five seconds, that would obviously help a lot. And if you do get some more title updates with achievements in the future as well, that would be awesome. So, yes, as I said earlier as well, if you do have a... Uh, turbo controller, of course, all you literally need to do is press, I mean, all you got to do is literally press Y and then right trigger. Uh, so just constantly keep spamming those two buttons with the turbo controller and you could literally leave it and off you pop and go shoot balls elsewhere. Oh, wait, I suppose in America that means basketball, right? Yeah, shoot some balls. Or shoot hoops. Either way, go shoot balls somewhere else. Uh, but of course, if you don't have a turbo controller like me, less sad. Um, again, you are literally just going to have to press the Y and right trigger and then just keep going, you know, get yourself some snacks, get a little uh, Netflix show going on, um, whatever it is it may be. I'm big into true crime stuff, so my Netflix is jam-packed with murdery stuff, which is, uh, uh, yeah... I'm not a psycho or anything, that's fine. Uh, but anyway, so just keep doing that, and uh, eventually, within a few hours, your achievement should unlock. So there we go, guys and gals. Can't beat a nice free and easy, can ye? So thank you so much for watching. I hope the guide helped. Thank you so much for watching again. Big shout out to all my Patreon supporters and YouTube members, and I shall see you in the next one. Big love!